Well, it starts off as a dwarf in the galaxy, but it has the potential to wipe out entire planets. We're talking about a supernova, and in some astronomy circles, scientists are predicting we could live to see it happen here. Brittany Morehouse looks into a new science discovery and its deadly implications. In a champagne supernova. There have been songs about it and movies about it. But what do we really know about a supernova? Well, it's powerful enough to blow up the Earth. And it begins with what astronomers call a reoccurring nova. It's two stars that are orbiting around each other. One of them is a sort of bloated gas giant star. And the other is a degenerate star called a white dwarf. The other star um, is having material mass ripped off of it and it sort of falls onto the white dwarf and the white dwarf gets annoyed and uh, once every 20 years it explodes. But let's just say those tiny burps every 20 years don't get rid of all the extra mass. Then there will come a time someday when it will become massive enough so it really gets ticked off and really blows itself apart. Basically wipes out both stars, uh, puts out tremendous amount of energy. A blast that one astronomer recently suggested could kill off Earth based on a new observation in space. That observation was made by this camera behind me. It's now at the Air and Space Museum. It's been in space since 1993 and only returned to Earth last year. It returned with countless pictures, one of a star called Pixitis, a reoccurring nova, and you can guess where we go from there. So, is this the end? It's the end of the world. Maybe, or then again, maybe not. Would there be something really serious happening on Earth? Doubt it. It's not something that personally I'm going to lose any sleep over. Brittany Morehouse, 9 News Now and WUSA9.com.